Okay, I had to answer the phone there. Alright, so I guess I can try hitting... Hitting in a diagonal direction to try to remove some of that mass. Let's see if that works. How confident am I that it's going to work? Let's say about a 70% chance. Actually, that was pretty good. It removed a lot of that gnarly, uh, cracked cortex. That was really good. Uh, this, is, this is just a low spot. It's not really going to affect this in the middle here. I just, if I see a low spot, I'll take it off if I can uh, and come back to the problem later, that problem in the middle later. I don't really think about a certain problem very long at all. I, I dismiss it and then I look at it fresh every few seconds. And uh, something might pop into my brain that says, hey, we can just hit it on the side like that and take it off instead of having to flake it off. I am going to have to thin from the base because the base is going to be very deeply notched or deeply concave and I want to do that before this gets t too thin I want to make sure this portion of the blade is stout when I start hitting that base because it will break and uh, the most important thing that goes through my head is do not break it, do not break it. Every strike is made, for me anyway, with the object, with the objective of not breaking the point. That's first and foremost. Second is what I want the flake to do. I want the flake to remove a certain amount of mass. This is helping some people. I know a lot of guys want to try this method. They've asked me many questions, and I'd like to thank everybody for all the messages and all the kind words and the compliments. It has given me a lot of confidence to uh, do a lot of these videos. I mean, to go for it, go ahead and, and do more of these videos, I mean. And, uh, thanks for all the subscriptions. Some guys uh, subscribed to my channel, I almost passed out when I saw that. I mean, Paleo Man Jim. He's one of my, he's one of my idols. When I saw him subscribe to my channel, I almost passed out. So yeah, thanks again. And I'll try to make these as clear as possible. And if you guys have any suggestions, anything you want to see, just go ahead and let me know. All right. Basically what I want to do now is um, carefully remove the mass from the middle so I can deeply notch it. There's a lot of mass in there so there's going to be a lot of work involved in that and uh, before I tackle that I'm going to take a little break. <laughs>